Yo, what's going on? It's your boy Busy back with another banger of a video. And today, based on the rules that I set in the last video, I'm going to be showing you guys how not only have to make in that video, literally the next day, which was the 13th of May, and using all of the rules that I placed, I absolutely crushed the markets yesterday. And it's a good feeling, even though that the amount isn't as great as I used to make before. But just seeing the fact that the wins are coming is really, really boosting my confidence. And I really want to share it with you guys and you guys can see for yourself how this has helped my trading move forward. So before we dive into the video, don't forget to subscribe, like, leave a comment if you're part of the BZ gang. Don't forget to join the Telegram channel. Links are in the description. Free signals every single day. So let's get right into it. So gang, let's dive right into the chart. As you can see, I've got some OTC pairs here. It's gonna remove them. Those are from a different session. Uh, so I'm gonna go around and add my regular pairs, which have very, very low um, returns, but I'm not really worried about that. Um, so Euro USD is gonna be one I'm gonna be focusing most on. And so you've seen me, I got like some two minute trades, two minutes, I told you I've, I've stuck to it. I've stuck to it as I told you, and you can see it's really been doing good for me. You know, little by little, you can see my loss and win rates. And so it's the same thing, uh, keep my strategy the same, just a little less amount of winnings that I usually do. Um, I think that, and I think it's something that probably you guys don't understand as well, because like when it comes to this whole trading thing especially when you're making content out of it um for me personally there's a lot of pressure and i know probably it shouldn't happen but there's a lot of pressure once you're doing trading videos especially in this like space that i'm doing with pocket options where most of my trades are happening in life and to compare that with other people who are in my lane who are also like putting out videos every day or even twice a day where they're making 20, 10 grand every week, every day, not even a week, bro, every day. And that's kind of the same thing where I want my content to be the same because that shows that I'm good at what I'm doing. But I think after, after I saw how you guys like accepted uh, the last video that I made and I see that you all supported me and I'm really trying to get out of that mind frame completely and just try to create and enter good, good trades for you guys. So it's like no more a competition of like how much eyeballs can I get to my content and how can I, you know, promote myself as a trader and more. So yeah, that's really one of the things that's been on my mind. I really wanted to say this before, before we started today. Um, so as you can see, I'm really looking at Euro USD right now and the way the market is moving, it's not really giving me any great ideas, but I'm going to shoot to M10 real quick. Just want to see how the market is because you can see here, it's been an upward trend. See the market just stuck there. So we're going to assume that the market is on the up and up. So definitely what we're thinking now in the back of our mind is that we want to enter into a call. So when we look, we can see that the markets have been moving, uh, hasn't been moving crazy at all. That's by the fact that we see, uh, can you see that? An upward trend being confirmed right there. But I'm worried if it's gonna be confirmed for a whole two minutes, but we'll enter $400 a call right there. Uh, another thing is, you know, a lot of, uh, um, Another thing that I'm really, really, really trying to make uh, the videos a lot better. And you can, if you go to my Telegram channel links in the description, you will see that we've made um, a lot of uh, improvements, not to the way, not only to the way that we give signals, but just with the way that um, we're communicating. And, you know, I sat down uh, and, you know, put, my thoughts and everything together and how I can, how can I improve uh, my signals? How can I do 
better for you guys so this is really being an eye-opening situation for me as well because not that i thought about it as like a side project but it was important that i give you guys um great signals but also what's very very important is having that situation where i'm more involved in the whole process uh you know because i felt like i've neglected uh the channel and not made it a lot about me and more just about that hey i give free signals and i think that most of all it's important people come there for the signals absolutely i get that but at the same time i feel like i could be giving you guys a little bit more so i'm definitely gonna tie it up on that and focus on more because just doing trading uh videos every single like what three times a week it can be a little exhausting and i think it's also one of the reasons why i've been seeing a lot of losses recently because i've been diving into the markets a little bit too much in a day and sometimes i'm in the market three four days and and sometimes you know you get a little bit of false confidence because as you can see we're able to take an 88 dollar profit on that so let's check and see where the market is still moving we can still see it bullish so maybe we'll continue to follow this trend oh my god pardon me guys hey no cuts so we'll keep that in there um so as you can see the only situation i'm a little bit worried about is maybe the market is going to touch this point as you can see reversal happened here reversal happened here and the possibility of a reversal happen is also high but I think we we'll just still follow that uh, trend because we're still close to touching it, but we're not there yet. So I think we'll just follow it. Nice. It's a nice to have that a little bit of a confirmation from M10. Uh, but I think we'll follow this trend up. Even though if we hit past that, by the time the price starts to drop, as you can see, We'll be looking now we've seen that price cross as you can see the price level has been rich so now we're expecting at some point for the price to drop but that won't happen immediately it could be a situation where it's after this candle but you can see that candle is still very bullish we don't see that price being pushed down at all in fact it's higher than the price that we thought it was going to pull down from so it looks like we're in good hands with 50 some seconds left, 55 to be precise. So I feel like this tile is really more encouraging. Uh, I'm able to enter trades and not like trying to dive in after every single win or loss and allowing my trades to develop a little more. And you know, you guys can see here as well, you can see how that is developed into helping me enter more profitable trades as you can see they've all been two minutes two minute trades and i've really been hitting it so right here we're we're hoping that the market would reverse that's what you'd be thinking but if we go to m10 we're just gonna wait we have about 17 seconds left right here i mean the profits aren't as, as high as we want to but i think dipping my toes slowly is really the way for me to go um i'm trying to keep my losses low as you can see another 88 dollars which is pretty nice um so let's see m10 again and now we're seeing it still bullish we don't see any cross over here so i think we might just i think the i think we might just continue to follow this trend upwards you can see you cross that barrier right there we're well over 80 and oversold i mean overbought my my bad so right now we're seeing we're starting to see the price push down a little bit and we're expecting a reversal here at some point i mean the second highest point we can find is at 107.936 and right now the price is at 108 now at the same time i'm not going to enter because none of my conditions have been met um a second none of my conditions have been met we can still see that the candle is bullish we've entered into two calls 
or looking to enter into a putt. Because we've seen it pass. But we don't see anything indicating a movement different in the markets right here. But I really think that we're way past the point. Now we're seeing that that candle isn't really driving as high as it was in the beginning. So this might be our chance to enter into a putt. You can see how indecisive that candle is. We're starting to see maybe not a dive here, but we see that we're past the highest point that's created before in the market. And we've seen that repeat here and here. So we're just hoping it, hoping that happens again. And as you can see, the market is following my, my thought process right there. So that's good. That's, that's three trades in. And the only thing I was a little bit worried about, because when you're going to two minute trades, is that there's going to be a lot of, uh, uh, a, lo a longer video and even though they even my one minute videos were a lot more uh the, i mean one minute trades and the videos were about 13 15 minutes now with two minutes it's gonna take uh about the same time but i think that i could really give you guys more information on the trades rather than me just seeing a good opportunity and i'm automatically just you know, entering into it and not like really thinking about like, is you guys really follow me or not? So that's really important. And I think that that's something else that might really, really skyrocket the um, amount of value that I'm giving to you guys. So we've got 30 seconds left on here. And another rule I want to do and I want to add and I want to know what you guys think about this is I want to do a three trade maximum for my videos so i'm coming in i'm doing three trades and whatever that result is i have to be okay with it and move on to the next one so to prevent not just only over trading but also uh allowing you guys to really see what it takes to manage your account so as you can see here we entered two trades we won them and one of those trades we broke even even though I think this market is still gonna dive a little bit downwards, but a promise is a promise. We've entered into our third trade of the day, very profitable day. And you can see yesterday too, after you can see the dates right here, the second date. So you can see after that, I've really been putting in work and I'm, I'm glad that you guys continue to support me. I thank everyone for showing love on the last video. Because I, I really didn't know how you guys were going to uh, feel about the whole changes that's going to be happening. And I understand that there's so many more, uh, how will I say, dynamic YouTubers there who are making content in my space. And they have like all of this crazy numbers of like never losing. But I'm glad that you guys have stuck with me. And don't forget to join the Telegram channel. Links are in the description. I've got free signals every single day as well as a VIP that's absolutely free. So don't forget to check it out. And thank you guys for joining me for another live session. It's been your boy Busy, and I'm out.